On this episode of Will It Work? I've got a couple beta movie video cameras that I'm gonna try to get up and running again. Stay tuned. All right, so here are the video cameras. These were given to me several years ago. This one still had the original box. And this one came with the carrying case. And I've got a few batteries here, but I've never actually tried getting them up and running because, well, I did not have a battery charger, but now I do. So I picked up a battery charger the other day, and we're gonna see if either one or both of these cameras can work again, because that would be really sweet to be able to record some video on beta tapes. So let's try it out and first see if the battery charger works. So we're gonna put the first battery in, turn it on, got power. It's not like the charge light is coming on. So maybe this is a bad battery. Let's try, let's try a different one. Battery, power it on. All right, charge light came on on that one. So let's charge the battery up, and then we'll see if either of the cameras will turn on with a charged battery. All right, got the battery charged. Let's pop it in. See what happens. Power button. Oh no, it does nothing. All right, let's try the other camera. Pop it in. Does nothing. Oh no, neither one of them works. Yeah, if you look on the contacts, looks like the battery has corroded in there at some point. So that's likely the problem. Hmm. Let's check the other one. Yep, same thing. So, we're gonna have to open these up, see if we can clean them off. All right, so I've opened up where the battery goes on this black beta movie player and I am clean off you see here the contacts where the battery goes pretty corroded I'm gonna try to clean this off as much as I can hmm, pretty gross get a little bit better all right so I'll keep cleaning this and see how it comes along all right, so I worked on cleaning out the corrosion from the battery compartment, and the way I did that is I took one side of the battery compartment off, and then where the corrosion was, I used this pick to kind of scrape it off gently, and then I took uh, Q-tips and a 99.9% .9 isopropyl alcohol, and I, I cleaned it off pretty well. It's not perfect, but it's much better than it was. Most of the corrosion is gone from it now. I've also removed this cover part from the uh, tape compartment. So you can see in there, you can see the video head and stuff. This is just uh, in case I need to pop this open whenever I put the battery in it. So we're going to set the battery on here and I'm going to see if I can eject the tape compartment now. Look at there. All right, it's doing something. 
let's put the battery compartment back together and see what happens when we put a tape in it. All right, I have the battery compartment put back together and the battery is in there. Let's make sure that it still ejects. All right, perfect, it does. Very nice. Flip it around over here. No power button, but let's put a tape in and see what happens. So I've got a tape here. Polaroid Beta. Looks like somebody had recorded Wall Street on it back in August 22nd, 1986. So let's see what happens when I pop this tape in. Alright, it loaded it. The head is spinning. Uh, let's see. All right, power button works now. Okay. Pretty awesome. Let's see. If I hit record, what's gonna happen? Uh, it tried to move and then it stopped. Did you see that? power turned off. Turn it back on. Let's try this again. Let's see if the zoom works. Zoom doesn't seem to be doing anything. Power is going back out now. The battery light was flashing. And now it won't do anything. Hmm. Curious. Let's take the battery out. Put it back in. Alright, it made some noises. Still ejects, that's good. Can you hear that noise? It's making a noise. And then it turns off. Okay. And then it won't do anything after that. Looks like we're going to have to open it up and get on the inside. Something is just not quite working properly. And I'm going to fix this eyepiece. But it looks like I'm going to use parts from this one to try and get this one going. This one didn't really seem to be doing anything after I cleaned the battery contacts. Plus, I had to steal the door to the battery case off of this one to put on the black one because it snapped off. It just kind of fell apart, like it was old and rotten. Might have been cracked from years ago. So we may have to take parts from one to get the other one working. And this one just started making noises again, like it's trying to do something. And then it stops. All right, let's open it up and see what it looks like on the inside. All right, so this thing wants to work, but it's not quite there. I had to switch tapes also. The other one, it worked, but it had like some good stuff on it. Uh, so I had to get one that has officer and a gentleman record on it, which I don't care about. 
so. But when we put it in, what the hell happened? Oh, here it goes. So it's making a noise like something's turning. You see this tape in here is loose and then it stops. It's loose down here too, as you can see. Okay, so let me get you caught up on what I have done since I, I did a lot of this stuff off camera just because there's tight spaces, camera would have gotten in the way. But if you look down in here, you'll see a belt that belt right there I have replaced. Here's the original one. It was a little loose, slack. So I put a new one in there, which was not easy. As you can see, it kind of runs under a bunch of different stuff. And so it was a pretty tight squeeze to get that in there. I also worked on the eyepiece a little bit. And so now it's whole, it's working pretty good. You can see there, not falling apart anymore. So, so now I'm gonna plug it in and see what happens when I put a tape in it. This battery charger also has power cord attached to it, so I do, do not have to uh, use a battery. I can actually just plug it in and test with. So we're gonna plug it in. Ooh, you see that? And put a tape in. Oh, took the tape. Ooh, okay. Looks like this tape has a little bit of mold on it. Not good. We'll get a new one before we really start using this thing. So now it's, it came in, it took the tape. The tape does not look slack in there. So let's press record and see what happens. Head spinning. Oh, the reel is spinning. Uh-oh, we might have a working beta movie video camera. Right now it's recording nothing because the lens cap is on. The microphone is unplugged, so it's not getting any sound. But it looks to be working. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna Go ahead while we got this open, clean the video head because it may be kind of grimy after all these years of not being used. Put it back together and see what happens. Stop recording. That seemed to work. Eject the tape. Hey, gave me the tape back. Didn't mess it up any. Sweet. All right, here we go. I've got it put back together now. As you can see, let's pop a new battery in there. Got one charged up. All right. See if the eject works. Ooh, eject worked. Let's pop the tape in. There's a different tape from earlier. No mold on this one. So start with a fresh tape. All right. It took it, hit power over here. There we go. Now let's see if we can record. Press the button. 
The tape is spinning. Take the lens cap off and see if we can get some footage. All right, I've been out recording some footage, so let's pop it in the player. Let's see what happens. See how it looks. Hey, check that out. This is out in the yard. Those are my dogs. Oh, there we go. Put that filter on. Yeah, that looks much better. All right, start back over with the filter. Sweet. Check it out. It works. It works. Look. That beta player is right there on top of the TV. It's on the TV. Oh my gosh. I'm watching a TV of the TV. Dang, that's trippy. Wow, that's pretty incredible. It's Pee Wee. All right, so here's where we stand in the end. Black beta movie video camera up and running. Works after years and years of not doing anything, sitting dormant. It is now working, has a snazzy new strap. Silver beta movie video camera, not so fortunate. It is not working. I actually had to take some parts from it in order to get the black one working. So, had to sacrifice the silver beta movie camera. It's now good for parts. If I ever need parts again, this is where I'll come to. But battery charger works. Batteries charge. It matches the camera, which is pretty sweet. I've got a carrying case for it. And I've got an original box. So there we go. That's the standing. This episode, will it work? Will work, does work, does not work, probably will never work. But that's where we're at. Pretty cool.